Hello, everyone, and welcome to Early Morning Prayer Request and Devotions. I hope everybody's all right this morning. On our prayer request, Beth asked for prayers for the firemen that are working continuously on the fires in Texas. Also pray they get them all put out. Um, a female deputy lost her life in the fires in Texas. Pray for comfort for the family. Shannon is going to have a procedure done on her back. Pray it helps because it really hurts. Lorena needs prayer for her brother Jerry and her family. Pray for Diane C's friend. He's in the hospital still. They said he needs an operation on his heart. Pray he'll be okay. Okay. And our scripture of the day comes from James 2, 1 through 4. My brothers and sisters, believers in our glorious Lord Jesus Christ must not show favoritism. Suppose a man comes into your meeting wearing a gold ring and fine clothes, and a poor man in filthy old, old clothes also comes in. If you show special attention to the man wearing fine clothes and say, here's a good seat for you, but say to the poor man, you stand there or sit on the floor by my feet. Have you not discriminated among yourselves and become judges with evil thoughts? All right. And our devotion today is entitled, And Seven Others. Tragedy struck near Los Angeles in January 2020 when nine people died during died in a helicopter crash. Most news stories began something like this. NBA superstar Kobe Bryant, his daughter Gianna, and seven others lost their lives in the accident. It's natural and understandable to focus on the well-known people involved in a horrible situation like this. And the deaths of Kobe and his precious teenager Gigi are heartbreaking beyond description. But we must keep in mind that in life's big picture, there's no dividing line that makes the seven others, Peyton, Sarah, Christina, Alyssa, John, Carrie, and Era, any less significant. Sometimes we need to be reminded that each human is important in God's eyes. Society shines bright lights on the rich and famous, yet fame doesn't make a person any more important than your next-door neighbor, the noisy kids who play in your street, the down-on-his-luck guy at the city mission, or you. Every person on earth is created in God's image, whether rich or poor. No one is favored more than another in his eyes, and each is in need of a Savior. We glorify our great God when we refuse to show favoritism whether in the church or in society at large. What can you do to show love for all mankind, rich or poor, famous or obscure? How did Jesus reveal this kind of love? Heavenly Father, help me to show love and kindness to all, regardless of their station in life. And Lord, I want to pray today for everyone on our prayer list. Please help all of them with their different needs and help anyone that's been affected by the virus. And also help that war to end in Ukraine, Lord. In Lord's name I pray. Amen. I hope you all enjoyed this early morning prayer request and devotions. If you did, I hope you'll press that like button. Also subscribe if you haven't already. And hit that so you get all my videos as soon as they come out. And share this out today. All right, everybody. Thanks so much for watching. And I hope to see you later on on Morning Coffee Break. Have a great morning and God bless.